Georgia's state budget touches the lives of people in every corner of our state. The annual spending plan outlines the state's priorities, details how it will spend money to try to meet them, and shows how it will collect enough revenue needed to pay for them. Georgia is slated to spend $45.2 billion in the 2018 budget year that began July 1, 2017. That total includes $25 billion in state funds, such as money collected from taxes on personal income and motor fuel, $14 billion in federal funds, and $6.4 billion in other funds, including tuition and fees paid by students at Georgia universities. The state budget this year is a slight uptick from the past few years, yet is still modest in historical terms. Where do the dollars go? Looking specifically at our general fund, which are dollars that come from our primary state taxes and fees, nearly 75% of spending goes to either public education, including K-12 schools, technical colleges and universities, or health care, including Medicaid. The remaining 25% goes to support transportation, public safety, human services such as child welfare, as well as a variety of other needs. Want more details? Our 2018 budget primer will walk you through the fine print of spending and revenues, including subjects such as how much Georgia loses each year from tax breaks, and whether we have an adequate savings account to meet our future needs as a state. A state budget is a moral document. It shows, once you sweep aside all the rhetoric, where lawmakers have chosen to commit taxpayer dollars and where they have not. Georgia can't thrive in the future without a willingness to make bold investments in our people and our communities. This has been a production of the Georgia Budget and Policy Institute.